Hello, my captain, and welcome now to Tuesday. Well, sunny, clear, focused, and yet hyper aware all at the same time. The moon is in Gemini, so emotional focus is again on your moment to moment reality. And today we are blessed with a temporary soul pyramid in air. What this does is trine three planets and what they call a grand trine in classic astrology, uniting three heavenly bodies or three parts of your awareness so you get a big picture, a soul pyramid view of your life. Now the epicenter is your feelings of reality. I argue in the next 24 hours Capricorns will feel a new reality, a new life potential. And this comes together with Neptune in Aquarius which is helping you intuitively reach a new height of value. You're being guided to what you're really worth. Thank you, Goddess, for that. And Venus in Libra. You're on the path of a new career. You're creating a new legacy. You're moving forward with this new legacy. So career changing, intuitively being guided to new heights of soul capital. As a result, life, reality, is starting to feel a little different. And the per perspective and prospects of life are different. Now this leads all the way to the Sun in Sagittarius. We're in Chapter 1 of Sun in Sag. No ruling planet today. Today it's time to assess the landscape of your weeds in your soul garden. All right. Now since life is changing, what about your subconscious needs to change? What sides of yourself hold yourself back? Now your career is moving forward and you're starting to see new value around the corner. What weeds, what boogeymen do you need to face? Let's clear these out. That's your question for today. And speaking of questions, today we've got a new episode of Just Ask Us starring Lauren Serafan, our practical Capricorn advice by the way. All you Capricorns should be out there supporting your fellow Cappy, Lauren, and Angelo Eros, our local triple air sign clairvoyant. They come together to answer a very provocative question that every Capricorn is going to want to see the answer of. This soul gardener writes us, she's a woman, married to a man for nine years, and she finds out in the last two weeks that he has an illegitimate 20-year-old child. What would you do? And is it even his child? Well, Angelo has that clairvoyant answer. and. Hear what a Capricorn has to say. They're live on camera together everywhere. Soul Garden Blossoms. Okay, Captain, that's all I have for today. But tomorrow, things get pretty emotional in your relationships, just so you know. Until then, live, love, be. Soul.